Hello and welcome to another video tutorial from ComputerGarGuard.com. This tutorial will look at using the ceiling function within Excel. The ceiling function is used to round up a number to a multiple significance or a number of decimal places. Uh, for example, you could round a number up uh, to a multiple of 10 or a multiple of 5, or you could round one up to maybe 5 decimal places or 2 decimal places. On the spreadsheet at the moment, I have four different numbers uh, formatted, you know, some with decimal places, one without. Uh, we're going to look at using the ceiling function uh, in different scenarios here. Starting off with the first one there in A1, if I type equals and ceiling, you can see Excel with its own explanation. It will round number up, it always rounds it up. There is another function called floor. Uh, that is the, the polar opposite of ceiling and will round a number down to a nearest integer or nearest multiple significance. For putting my opening brackets, so it asks for my arguments, they are number and significance. Number is the number you are looking to round, so in this scenario it is A1. And significance, putting my comma there, is the number of decimal places or multiple of significance. This example, we want to round it to one decimal place, which should present the answer of 5.4. Uh, despite it being 329, remember it's always going to round it up, so that will be to 5.4. I'd put 0 0.1 to represent one decimal place, please, and I have 5.4. In this second example, let's have a look at another ceiling function. I might want to round this... Uh, to zero decimal places. For that, the significance will be one. Yeah, so no decimal places. And it rounds it straight up to three, 2.7 up to three. Another ceiling function. Uh, this will go 0 0.1 again. So have one decimal place, 4.56. This should be 4.6. And for a final one, we'll do things a little bit different. I'll try and spell ceiling to start with. That would help. I love these little little netbook keyboards. I'm going to use a multiple of significance for this one. Now we have 23. Uh, we would like to round it up uh, for a multiple of significance of 5. Uh, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 is the answer we're expecting. So if I put 5 as my multiple, and we have 25, round it up a multiple of 5. Now that is it, that is the ceiling function, hope you have found it useful, uh, if you have done please check out what else we have to offer, uh, check us out at computergargot.com, check us out on YouTube, tons more office tutorials for you there, uh, get in touch and see you soon, bye for now.